Chapter 4, Understanding the Desktop Desktop When Windows is loaded you see the desktop. This means that the computer is ready to use. The desktop of the computer displays icons and taskbar. The taskbar contains the start button, date and time and many other quick launch tools. There are two ways you can start or open any program, file, folder or application from the desktop. 1. Double click on the icon present on the desktop. Or 2. Click on start and select the desired program from the start menu. Important icons on the desktop. This PC. In a computer, data is stored in storage devices such as the hard disk, pen drive or digital video disk, DVD. This PC displays all drives present on the computer. These drives are given special names such as C and D drive respectively. Network. Network displays all the computers that are connected by local area network LAN. You can use it to exchange and access common files across computers. Recycle bin. Where do you discard all your waste paper? Yes, in a dustbin. Similarly all the unwanted files and folders on the computer that are no longer needed can be moved to the recycle bin. But all deleted files still occupy memory. Just as you need to empty the dustbin in your classroom regularly, you need to empty the recycle bin on your desktop to manage the available memory space. If you accidentally delete a file you can recover it from the recycle bin before you empty it. By right clicking on the required file and then click in G on the restore option. If you click empty recycle bin option, the files are completely erased from the computer memory and cannot be recovered anymore. Emptying the recycle bin also makes additional space available to store data. Google Chrome. It is one of the popular web browsers. It helps you to surf information on the internet. In case, this icon is not displayed on the desktop, one can download and install Google Chrome from the internet. Create a desktop shortcut. Many a times, you may use certain programs or files very often. Therefore, you would like to open them quickly and easily. You can do this by creating shortcut icons for them and placing them on the desktop. To create a shortcut. 1. Right click on any file slash folder. 2. A menu appears. Select send to option and click on desktop, create shortcut. 3. The shortcut is created and you can now double click to open the file slash folder.